So I wanted to make a image, this image, and have it look a bit faded so it's a background image and doesn't take away from what I'm going to put on top of it for one of my videos. And I'm in Adobe Photoshop and you would think that brightness would be the way to do it. Um, but really, brightness just makes it dark and really bright. It doesn't fade it. So then I looked into one that they call, what is it called? Faded photo. And I went, okay, that seems logical. But when you put it on, it just mutes the colors and I think it's kind of ugly. So I didn't want that either. So what I did was went into layers and click the layer that I want and I use the opacity which basically is how much you can look through it and typically you use this so if you have several layers you can see through each layer and see what's underneath almost like looking through a frosted window I guess you can think of it that way but I want it to fade now this checkered board sign, I had put it down to 47. I think I want a little more, a lot more. But see this checkered board means transparency. How much you can see through this image. So I'll save this and I will show you what it looks like. So now I have the picture of what it looks like faded and it's exactly the nice fade that I wanted. Oops. Um, if you want to see what it looked like beforehand, that's the before and that's the after. So it's just, it does look faded. And I think it's a great way to make it look faded than the little techniques or the little uh, programs they have inside of Adobe Photoshop. And that's your faded photo.